Yeah. Can't fuck? Probably. <laughs> Is there one item there yeah, that you can't pull fuck? Up something, pull up something that you can't fuck, Dan. We'll prove it right Let's now. Prove it. Yeah. Do you hear this laugh yet? The laugh yet? Hassan's agent's coming to him and he goes, oh, this is the next big guy. You got to have him on. He's going to be the next big comedian. Bigger than Brittany Broski. <laughs> so we've got something going on here. Let's hear a little bit more. I'll tell you why I actually have to hate him. No, I feel like I kind of have I a pretty annoying do. laugh. It's not like this. <laughs> no, if you did that, yeah, you'd be drawn. I draw on you. That's Ooh, like his laugh and my tone. Oh, God, and what are you looking at? <laughs> Look at this. I turn to my TV. I see this. <laughs> Sorry, Sebastian. Jesus Christ. You're crooked. <laughs> you are a crooked man obsessed with sex. You sh Any person you make have sex with you is a rape. Just know that. to talk about Stav V. Stav Rose taking the world by storm. You know, so many people begging me to cover this guy. He was never really on my radar till w when he put that special out, right? You know, I know he's from Come Town, of course, which we're very dear friends with. I, uh, we've gone many times <laughs> over to their house for dinner. So many. And uh, so, but I had never really known about this Stavros guy, and there's so much talk about him recently. Uh, but it started uh, appalling me here. I've, you start seeing him on all these shows. He was just on the H3 podcast. What kind of comedian can you be going on H3, and why is that guy on their radar? I had no idea. He was on Rogue. Uh oh. And it took me uh, only a few seconds to figure out why he's so hated. Do we have him in up next here? We got a list of this. Uh, here, I didn't. I, it doesn't matter. It. Just pull up anything. <laughs> do you want him on Rogan or do you want him on H3? Uh, it doesn't matter. It could be anything. Anything he's on, he's going to ruin with one simple trait. You could give me H3 just because I don't want to do Spotify. Coming right up. Uh, he was on H3. You've seen this bald guy. I heard he's a sex freak. So who's talking about? I saw on Rogan, he was like, yeah, I was off Instagram for like four years, but then, you know, I needed to find some pussy. So I went, I'm like, what? You? And of course, you know, he gets called Dennis Franz, all that. But yeah, he does look like worse Dennis Franz. So it's, it is shocking to hear him talk about pussy and stuff like that. Uh, is it in messages? Okay, yeah, here he is on the H3 podcast. And you'll see very quickly... Why most people hate him, and this is definitely why I have to hate him for life. Uh-oh, check this out. No, nope, no. Try that. Okay, here. Two. Oh, now grab by with a... There he is. With oh, Eden hello, Clyde. everybody. Cheers, <laughs> everybody. It's the H3 Podcast. More. A beautiful Wednesday day. Joined by the Woo! incredible, highly requested... Oh, there we go. Stavros Helkius. Did I say your last name right? Why would he be highly requested? Here he is. This is the man. Yo, they'll cut through him. Why is he highly requested, folks? What's it's going on? Star. What's happening? What's he been up to? What What is the deal? He nailed it. Okay, good. Yeah. Watch it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's what I like to hear. That's what I like to hear. Yes. <laughs> yes. Let's go. Let's fucking go, baby. Actually, you got a ton of fans here in the studio. Well, I right? love it. Why? Uh, when? They've been, How? They've been I can tell. They've been trying. You know, your friend. Actually, we have a lot of overlap in our lives. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. You do? Why? On the stream. Yeah. He's claiming we were just on Hassan's stream. Yes, apparently I read on the Red Scare this. Reddit that Listen he to this. has the same agent as Hassan. He has the same agent as Hassan. So all of a sudden, Mr. Cumtown, who's only known by the townspeople, of course, is what they call their fans. I hope. Uh, he was only known by townspeople. And then all of a sudden, he's on Rogan, he's on this, he's on this. Everybody's talking about him. And then we find out he just hooked up with Hassan Piker. Same agent, and apparently this guy has been dishing him out, and because he's just a comedian, the people he's dishing him out to, like, actually, he don't know. He don't know nothing about this guy. Hassan's agent's coming to him, and he's oh, this is the next big guy. You got to have him on. He's going to be the next big comedian. 
bigger than Brittany Broski. <laughs> so we've got something going on here. Let's hear a little bit more. I'll tell you why I actually have to hate him. I mean, to be a plus size man, despicable. Fucking liar. <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> he told, yeah, he's a liar ass. Yeah, yeah. He told me technically he's overweight. Yeah, somebody Get in the, the check goes, wait, it. somebody in the check goes, wait, they, they have agents? Yes. What do you think? This happens by magic? You know, people always ask me, Mike, why aren't you all? You have to do that yourself. Everything that you see them do, they've done themselves. They don't just wake up one day and they end up on the H3 studios. They drove there. They solicited. They campaigned. Do you know to get a YouTube plaque, you must fill out a form? Mm -hmm. Did you know to get verified, you must fill out a form? They're campaigning for these things. So he's at home. And, and, and I want, I want, I want, I want to be this. I want a YouTube plaque. I want to be on H3. I want to. And the agent is going out there and he's too fat and stupid to do it. He's found a man to do it. And the man is doing that. And then we're sitting at home. We can't wait for him to deliver us a Manscaped ad. Oh, I can't wait. Thank you. Another Manscaped salesman has now entered the community. Thank you. I can't wait. And, and this is happening. I mean, you're just watching it in real time. Every week, there's a new podcaster. He's everywhere. He's got a special or something. He's Manscaped. He's Signal Wire. He's in the mix. It, it's just because they're all, you know, to swing. So that's what he has done now. But the thing is, from all I hear, is how despicable this guy is. And now that this community is trying to snuggle his way into, there's no way they're going to put up with him. You know? From the stories I've heard, I hope these stories aren't true. I hope he's just a nice guy. But, you know, he's got the merch. Look at this. The merch is printed. He's wearing his own merch. It's already printed up. I mean, he's got this whole thing ready to go. These guys are ready to go. I think that's his merch. I think that that's... Well, he's in it. Guy he's in it. From Instagram. I mean, that's his face. <laughs> it's very, it looks just like it. Well, it's him. Believe me, they're in cahoots. <laughs> he's selling the shirt. Trust me, he's getting a coin from that shirt. All right, let's hear why I hate him, though. It's not just because he's a massive sellout, everything that we're supposed to be against, but we have forgotten, of course. Here. Bitch. Shut the hell up, you <laughs> Turkish piece of shit. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, the Greeks and the Turks, is there some... We've, yeah, yeah, we've got a blood feud. Yeah, blood feud. I'm there. still kind of trying to Trojan horse him. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get all the... I'm trying to get the codes... I'm trying to get the codes to his mansion. Yeah, and then yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fucking, he Fuck. lets me in. Mm. I'm taking all his, like, protein candies. <laughs> I'm taking all his, all his fucking shit. Uh, today's Watch. episode is sponsored Keep by listening. Adam and Eve. Okay, we can't listen to this. Ease. But we got, a, we got a loophole because you can sell dildos on Amazon... Oh, interesting. Right? Okay. And Amazon, they straight up buy ads right. on YouTube. Oh, here's There's Ethan Klein, of course, selling dildos and deviant satanic sex devices to his 13-year-old female fans. I mean, this is an audience of children. This is what your children are Imagine if your children was watching Sesame Street and they did Adam and Eve dildo ads. You would be <laughs> appalled. They would be burned to the ground. You would demand they be taken off the air. This is what's happening. Your children are watching this now, and they're learning about dildos, lies, deceit, weight gain. This is not where you want your kids. Take your kids off. If your kid is on YouTube, you might as well be on the Playboy channel watching Night Calls with Sam Tripoli. Oh, can they bring back Night Calls? Man, it's, every time I think about Night Calls, I want to start watching Night Calls, but it's too outdated. Who was trying to do, I, f I just had a vague memory. Yeah, of somebody trying of to recreate. Someone, night. If anybody got any cool, pornographic, like, night calls type stuff, send trying, it over. Oh, I know what it was. Yeah. It was on H3 when Cameron of the H3 crew called Bro. into that porn girl's yes. Twitch stream. And then she was like, oh, yeah. so what's your favorite sex position? And then he was like, oh, I don't know about that. Was I'm she just... sitting completely naked, showing everything? And I was like, Cam, no. she's trying to do night calls yes, here exactly. and you're ruining yeah, yeah, yeah. it. Yeah, well, a lot so. of people are doing it, but they're not doing the nudity of night calls is why you tuned in. They were fully naked doing a talk show. That's huge. If these people got fully naked... This would be great, but they're not. They're fully clothed in their own merch. Very cheap, cheap merch. They're never showing anything. And this is what your kids are watching. The Playboy channel is a better place for your child right now. It's very slow. There's a lot of weird scenes of women in diners eating cherry pies slow. 
they get undressed. It takes them 40 minutes to get undressed in these scenes. <laughs> it's fine for your kids. This is worse. Watch. It's true. And so I was like, well, it's an e-commerce website. So Smart. Adam and Eve, they're Hell also, yes. they just do e-commerce. They do e-commerce. And, you know. What other shit they got on there? That's they got anything question. you can't fuck? Probably. <laughs> <laughs> is there one item there yeah, that you can't pull fuck? Up something, pull up something that you can't fuck, Dan. We'll prove it right yeah, now. Prove it. Yeah. Do you hear this laugh yet? The laugh yet? I can't even imitate it. I tried for 100 hours. <laughs> no, I, I can't think do this it. This has something to do with us falling asleep to him two nights in a row. No, the first I've night was this. on Rogan, and the second. No, night I've was seen this. this on Twitter. I've seen this on Twitter. <laughs> okay. They're not okay with the laugh. This guy laughs like a dolphin after every word that comes out of his mouth. And two hours into this, we're watching Rogan. Two hours in, I really wanted to draw uh, <laughs> myself. I almost took out my bedside safe, typed in the digits. Put this whole gun together. It's a 3D printed gun that I don't even have, have, have assembled yet. I was going to blow my fucking head off with this gun. You'll see what I mean. It's going to build it out. My rather favorite quick. e-commerce website. <laughs> I love e-commerce. Yeah, yeah. He's laughing at he You know, hard. import, export. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You hear yeah, this? Uh, by the way, after congratulations on your... Oh, so they sell laundry. There we go. You can't fuck uh, that. You can fuck in it, though. Right. Is there anything uh, not fucking anything? That's right? true. You're a beekeeper's outfit. You can you know, put a mean, hole in it and get your dick sucked. <laughs> You're right. Fine. It's between everything, and the more they get this guy going, the more he starts getting gassed. The more the ha 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 ha. I can't even imitate it. I haven't laughed that much in my whole. You gotta try your best, life. at least. <laughs> I can't. I don't have the. Blah, 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 blah. I can't do it. It's like when Ludacris went shimmin and and welcome to Atlanta. I can't do it. <laughs> well, I feel like I kind of have I a pretty annoying laugh. There, it's not like this. <laughs> no, if you did that, yeah, you'd be drawn. <laughs> I draw on you. That's Ooh, like his laugh you. and my tone. Oh, God, and what are you looking at? <laughs> Look at this. I turn to my TV. I see this. <laughs> Sorry, Sebastian. Jesus Christ. Where's your Sephora? Is he going to do a chin for My Sephora <laughs> was dropped. What the fuck, Klein? <laughs> Klein knows me. His wife knows me. They hate us. Give right. me something non-sexual on that. I'm a racist website. to Klein. Looks like they have a bath and body <laughs> section. Oh, oh there we go. God. There we go. So My you're caught dead. You're hanging out with fucking Ethan Klein all day. I'm sorry, but as Bill Hicks says, you have fallen off the paramedic rooster, bro. You're fucking finished. And look how dis I mean, you're sorry. You're so disgusting. You look like a Victor J. Prattley original. <laughs> I know that's like surface level. That's what everyone says about you. I mean. <laughs> you're crooked. You are a crooked man obsessed with sex. You sh Any person you make have sex with you is a rape. Just know that. I don't care if she says she wants to. You're <laughs> raping her, and she's traumatized for life. You and this amico having sex. Not on my watch. I don't want this amico or him touching a woman. It's rape. Go near a woman, it's rape. And that's what he's getting into now, the H3 13-year-old girl audience, and he keeps making comments. Yeah, DM me. I'm always looking for something. DM me, join in. So I understand the hate with this Stavros. Now send me in any incriminating stuff about him. I'll sniff him out. Or it'll be like Michael Knowles where I'll find out he's good. That could happen to you too. Here's your chance to convince us. You could convince us. That's why Red Bar is so powerful. You know, we Can uh, you guys start including Michael Knowles with us? Like, you know how you would yeah, normally leave a comment us. where you're like, Oh, hey, Stavros, Mike is so mad yeah. at you right now. He's furious. Now you can be like, hey, Stavros, Mike and Michael Knowles are so mad at you right now. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes, that, yeah, include Michael, Michael Knowles. Like is my real. own laugh sounds I like am not mad. Laugh. I am not mad. Me and Michael Knowles on the town buying shit. New York City, me and Michael Knowles. Slow motion limo open, me and Michael Knowles. He probably loves shopping. You carrying our fucking bags behind us as be we honored. go to Brooks Brothers. Michael Knowles, call me. I'll do a shopping spree with you. On me. On me. And that goes for any person on the right. 